Welcome back, Theme Park Wizard, and well, Jessica Rabbit is getting more of a story and a lead here on Roger Rabbit. Um, as you may have noticed, it's in video is posted by Five Fires. Definitely go check him out. Mondo's awesome. I've met him a couple times then. And Dave from Fresh Bait. They noticed that Jessica Rabbit, the Jessica Rabbit fear is taken out of the trunk on Roger Rabbit's ride. And now, according to the OC Register, Disneyland is going to make Teen Titan ride more relevant with Jessica Rabbit and now the central character. So almost like the, what they did with Pirates of the Caribbean, uh, where they made the redhead the lead, or not. I guess she's not the central character, but no, they gave her more of a prevailing role instead of being like the wench. So, Roger Rabbit's cartoon spin is a new plot twist. Those Jessica Rabbit's the lead role is a private eye term to stamp out a Teen Town crime wave. So, basically, what's happening here is um, Jessica Rabbit's going to be a female character. Revamp backstory. And this continues with that inclusion thing they're doing, you know, with Pirates, with Splash Mountain, and now here we go with Toontown. Um, and let's see what we got here. So, some some scenes featuring just Rabbit are being updated to be more relevant, so that way she's out of the trunk, and it's going to reflect the new twist in the character's story. Uh, so the scene featuring just Rabbit and the Weasels with an automobile, as well as the final scene of Roger Rabbit's cartoon spin are being updated according to Disney and officials. Roger Rabbit's cartoonsman is latest attractions to undergo a major renovation with Pirates, Splash Mountain, and Jungle Cruise. Attractions are updated from time to time for a variety of reasons according to Zan officials. Um, so yeah, the updated storyline turns Jessica Rabbit into the news private eye as she tries to stop Toontown's crime wave. You know, uh, uh, I mean, I guess, look, I love Roger Rabbit. Absolutely love Roger Rabbit. Uh, the movie, uh, I'm an urban planning major, and Roger Rabbit, the movie, is a fantastic um, urban planning type movie. I think it's one of the best urban planning movies of all time, especially for general audiences. Um, it basically shows the creation of how the freeways were made here in Los Angeles, uh, but in a very Disney way. But I don't know. So Snow White obviously got an update as well. Um, but that one continues the story. It just updates the trash with new technology. Like, you know, they updated with Peter Pan and Alice. But Splash Mountain, the Jungle Cruise, and the, the Pirates. Um, Pirates actually wasn't like a big deal to me. But, you know... I don't know. I just feel like I just hope it doesn't change the story because the whole reason for these dark rides is they tell a story of the movie, you know. So if, even if the movie's made in 1950 or 1929 or whatever, they tell the story of the movie of of how of they the story of the movie. So sure, something in 1929 won't be there'll be some things that aren't appropriate or not look maybe frowned upon as of today, but it's important not to change all of the elements because then it just takes away the whole ride's original storyline of basically telling the movie. So I don't know. I'll we'll have to see the new Roger Rabbit by the time this is done. Um, I'm just glad they're not taking it away. I love Roger Rabbit, so I'm glad they're not demolishing the ride or retheming the ride. It's a fantastic ride, fantastic movie. But Jessica stopping crime, I mean, I I guess that could be, I mean, maybe like in, in continuation. Uh, almost, I feel like, I feel like maybe if they were to do a sequel to Roger Rabbit, maybe that would this would be the sequel. Jessica would be in a female-led role, uh, stopping crime. And man, if it's if they can do a Roger Rabbit sequel, I'd be all for it. Um, if they even based off this ride, I'll still take because I love that two D animation mixed with the live action like that. I absolutely loved loved it with Space Jam. The first one, and I loved it with Roger Rabbit. I love those type of hybrid movies, so I'll take this uh, Roger Rabbit too. But hmm, am I right with this? I mean, yes, of course I'm right with this. So, right, but I just hope it doesn't take too much away from the actual 
storyline of the actual movie, which I think was, a, again, a fantastic movie, especially uh, one of the great urban planning movies of, of all time, especially for commercial audiences. Um, and this is, again, speaking from an urban planning major, so many of you may not care about that at all, which I totally understand. But uh, speaking from like an urban planning major, great, great movie. Um, and just cool, fun movie in general. But what do you guys think? Um, will you ride Roger Rabbit? I'm sure, ho I hope most of you still will. I still will. It shouldn't be too, it doesn't sound like it's too big of a change, but definitely changing up the storyline. Maybe, it sounds like something definitely more than the Pirates, you know, Pirates uh, uh, revamp. Maybe more like, more like the Jungle Cruise, which is a couple new scenes and revamping the story. That's what, I feel like that would be at the level of this. Um, a couple new scenes or revamped scenes and a changing of the story of the attraction. But let me know what you guys think of Jessica Rabbit coming the new lead character, central character of um, Roger Rabbit's cartoon spin. I'm also just glad that not, they're not taking her away because when I saw her out of the trunk, I'm like, I hope they replace her, um, even if it's a different position. I hope she's not being out of the, uh, completely taken out of the attraction entirely, which I'm so glad that She's not being taken out of the uh, attraction. She will be featured even more so in the attraction, which is awesome. And hopefully they don't diminish Roger Rabbit's role because he's hilarious. So, um, yeah, what do you guys think about this new change and the latest of the inclusion changes to Disneyland? Uh, let me know in the comments below. I think it's I think it'll be perfectly fine. I'll wait. I'll reserve judgment until my, again, it opens and I write it. But so far, it, it seems like it'll be a-okay. But let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Subscribe for more theme park updates, and as always, have a fantastic day.